So I had this thought today. What if our lives are just a small fraction of the real big picture and you just don't know it? Daphne here, welcome to day 15 of Raising My Manifesting Vibration to get what I want. If you're just joining me, please watch my intro video as well as days 1 through 14 so that you know exactly what I'm talking about. So I had this epiphany today. What if our earthly bodies, you know, and everything that's going on around us is just a game in the big picture and it's more like, you know, I'm really trying to find the way to put this into words and you know reading through the manual it talks about being a powerful manifesting being and acknowledging that everything that you get is through manifesting whether you do it on purpose or not so let's just take that for a second that it no matter what we're doing, we're creating it. So, everything that we're doing, we're creating. You know, in our little group, we know that that's exactly what we're doing. But if you aren't part of my little group and, you know, and you aren't on that boat yet, just play along with me here. So, let's say that ultimately we are this being or this, you know, some people may call it a soul, but something that powers, you know, who we are. You know, something beyond our physical selves. And that, you know, again, just roll along with me here. So let's say that we start out as, we'll just call it a spirit, right? So we have a spirit that inhabits our body. What if our spirits were, you know, with all the other spirits in heaven, whatever you'd like to call it, and you know, and the a supreme being, God, whatever you'd like to refer to him or her as, for the sake of this argument, we're just going to go with God. So God says, hey, it is your turn to go down into earth, and I want to see what you can do. Show me what you can do. Now, there's one little trick, is that you aren't going to remember any of this. this. You're going to start anew, start fresh, and you're going to, have to, to, going to have to discover this all on your own. You're going to have to discover coming back to me and being in your spirit and concurrently inside of a physical form. And that you can do anything that you want to once you reach this state of enlightenment. And it's up to you to do it, but once you, once you come back around to me, once you come full circle and realize what it is that's going on, your potential is unlimited. You know, and I thought about this today, and in, you know, in the manifesting uh, in the Raising Your Manifesting Vibration manual, it talks about just accepting the fact that you're an infinite being and that you create all of this. And I just kind of ran with it to think of it as something more, and I, th I feel like I just finally got it. Like, I, you know, I'm the writer of my own book, I'm the maker of my own dreams, I'm, I'm the one who's in control of all of this, and you know, I haven't realized it up till now, so because I wasn't aware of it, wasn't conscious of it, there's no way that I can control it. It just goes. And, you know, some people reach that level a lot sooner than others. And there's nothing wrong with that. You know, I'm turning 30 this year, I'm just getting it. I know, uh, you know, a lot of people are older than that. And they're just getting, they're younger than that, they're just getting it. And it, it doesn't make any difference how old you are. It's just, it's the right time for you to accept the information. I've been blessed with, you know, my 
aunt really starting all of this and getting this fire built up around my mom, my other aunt, and, you know, in turn for me, I've been able, exposed to this a lot longer than what they did. So it's, you know, I'm able to get that advantage, you know, and thanks to them and taking that step, you know, and going into these uncharted waters, these unfamiliar things, you know, that takes out a lot of the legwork for me and that I'm able to come to this realization a lot sooner. Like, I'm getting goosebumps just talking about it and thinking about it. And, you know, I'm halfway through, like, um, I'm halfway, well, I guess not halfway through my 30 days because I still have a couple of extra days. My 30 days here is up on July 26th. So today is the 6th, so I have about three weeks, you know, left to make my 30-day goals come full circle. And I really feel like I, I really feel that I can do it. I don't think that I can do it. I don't think that it's possible. I know it's possible because now I understand that I'm the one who's writing all of this. I'm the one that's doing all of this. It's not things that are just happening to me. And you know what the... You know, it's not, you know, all of these other situations. All of this stuff is going to go on around me, but I have direct control over what happens in my life. Now that I'm aware of that, I can start making sure that that stuff happens. And you know what the wonderful, amazing thing is? Is that it's like that for every single person. Not just me, not just the people that are reading this manual, but every single person has this potential has this ability to do it and it's just discovering it and finding in yourself the path getting yourself there if you're watching this I hope that you've watched all of you know the previous 15 videos and that you are interested in what it is that I'm doing and what's going on so you are taking a step in the right direction and I hope that if this information doesn't hit with you right now that maybe you'll bookmark this particular video and come back to it you know maybe a month down the road or maybe even a year down the road it might resonate with you a lot better but know that you watching this video is putting things in to place whether you've done it subconsciously or you've done it purposefully this video is playing some sort of integral part in your life, whether you want it to or not, as well as everything else that you watch, everything that you listen to, everything that you do. It's not just this video. It's everything that's going on in your life. And I'm, I just got it. And it's such an amazing feeling. I'm going to focus on that. I've got my um, eight steps that I need to do. There's a shortcut PDF in there uh, in the manual. So I'm going to take to that and I'll have, I'll give you an update tomorrow after I've gotten an entire day doing, um, you know, as many things as I can possibly implement, um, which will be all of them. Um, but if you're watching this, just know that you, you're, you're going to get it. If you don't get it right now, you're going to get it. It's going to happen as long as you stay on this path and you continue to search because I've been searching for this for a long time and, you know, since 2006 really is, is what I can tell you that I first, 2007, I'm sorry, 2007 I've been searching, but for the last three and a half months, I've really, really been like on it, reading reading, 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 and listening to audiobooks, and I just finally got it. So if you have been trying to get it for a long time, quit trying to get it and just focus on whatever it is that you're reading and take in as much information as you can because I didn't sit down with this thought today or I didn't sit down and try to think about it. I just was sitting there and I happened... Uh, to start doing my exercises about focusing in the now and what it feels like and this thought just popped into my head. So don't get discouraged. Keep going, keep doing and eventually it will come. Whether it's a couple of months, a couple of weeks, 
couple of years just stay focused on putting nothing but the good stuff in and eventually you're going to be putting nothing but the good stuff out and it all comes full circle. So I hope that you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please leave me a comment below. Give me a like. Um, make sure to share this with your friends. Maybe somebody else could find this uh, enlightening or interesting. And I will see you tomorrow on day 16. I'm really excited.